That's actually a, another good question. And if you knew nothing about bicycle touring, you might think that bicycle travelers carry their belongings, like their tools, clothing, camping gear, food, etc., in a backpack that they carry on their back. I know that's what I thought when I first started bicycle touring. But, but carrying your gear in a backpack is not the typical approach. And the reason that you don't want to carry your things in a backpack is because using a backpack for days on end is going to make you hot, sweaty, and sore. And, and getting hot, sweaty, and sore on a, on a long distance bike tour is what you want to avoid. Uh, if you try to use a backpack, I bet your tour will come to an end a whole lot sooner um, than if you had used one of these other strategies that I'm going to tell you about right now. So instead of using a backpack, there are two main ways that bicycle travelers carry their gear and thus eliminate any excess pressure on their back, neck, or body. So they either use a set of panniers, or also pronounced panniers. Um, panniers are backpack-sized bags that attach to the front and rear racks of your bicycle. They're shaped kind of like a small backpack, and a standard touring bicycle can carry up to four of these panniers on the bike at any one time. The other strategy is to use a trailer, uh, a one- or two-wheeled metal cart that's pulled behind your bicycle. And so, th so those are really the two main ways that people carry their gear, panniers and trailers. Now, which is the best way to do it? Well, that's a, that's a debatable question, and, and, and honestly, the answer to that question depends on the type of bike tour that you're going to be doing. Uh, I will mention this hundreds of times on Bicycle Train Pro, but the type of bike that you use and the way that you carry your gear, panniers, trailers, etc., is going to depend on the bike tour that you're, you're conducting. For the most part, however, most people conducting bicycle tours will use a set of panniers, either two panniers carried on the rear rack or four panniers, two on the back and two on the front of the bicycle. So I conducted a survey at Bicycle Train Pro where I surveyed like 10,000 people who had been on bike tours and I asked them uh, which they had used on their trips, panniers, a trailer, or a backpack. And of those I surveyed, 92% said that they used a set of panniers on their bicycle when they were, when they were touring. Only 7% said that they used a trailer and 1% used a backpack. So I don't know if those numbers are, are entirely 100% accurate, but I think based even just on my own experience and seeing other bicycle tourists out on the road, I can tell you that the majority of people are using a set of panniers um, with, with a small percentage using a trailer. Um, and there are advantages and disadvantages to both, um, but for most people I think uh, a rear rack and a set of panniers is what they need to at least get started.